here's something you didn't know. I was a child actor. Here, look at my headshot. See that denim jacket with the collar popped? Yeah, I was killing it. My mom had been some kind of like failed actress in the 70s. So when I was old enough to act, she transferred all of her broken hopes and dreams onto me. She would take me to the auditions, teach me my lines, right? Because like, I don't really understand how like kids know how to act. Like how did that little kid from Jerry Maguire who was like the human head gave eight pounds? How did he know how to be like charming and funny? When I was eight, I didn't even know what my arms were. So we'd go to the audition. I'd read a couple lines and then I got taken to McDonald's. It was amazing. Anyway, I had booked a role on a Hershey's chocolate syrup commercial, so my career was basically on fire. My mom drove me into an audition, and she couldn't find a parking spot. And I was like, Mom, don't worry. This is my craft. I don't think I need to be guided on the lines anymore. I think I got this. So I go upstairs. This is the first time I've ever gone in without her. They give me the script, and they're like, please state your name for the camera. I'm like, hey, I'm Josh. And then they're like, great, go ahead. So I launch into the lines, and I'm like, I got hit with a baseball. Entire room is silent. Guy's like, um, okay, do you think we could try that again? And I'm like, okay, okay, I feel that. Let me get in the groove. And I'm like, I fell down the stairs. And like, they're like, mm, no, can you give, give us one more? And I'm like, all right, this one, I'm giving it my all. My career is too hot to fizzle now, so I go for it. And I'm like, I got hit with the closet door. Spin around and then land in some kind of like a weird split. The entire room is shocked. <gasps> The woman is like, Josh, you know that this is a PSA for child abuse, right? And I'm like, oh, oh my God. Because I did not realize these were supposed to be children's excuses for things you like tell your teacher at school for why you have bruises. So I ran out basically crying because I had blown it. My career was over. I got outside. My mom was double parked at a fire hydrant. And I was like, you embarrassed me. You ruined my life. And I never acted again. I gave it up to pursue my dream of being a professional baseball player. 